All right, y'all, we finna get right into it. Y'all know what I'm on, my ex feed. Let's get into it, y'all, because we're definitely going to probably find some meltdowns. I know Trump is dropping, like, big names of who he's taking in the White House with him in January. And it's so dope because he is building a great team. And he's building it with the ones who has had his back since day one. You call those day ones. Those that, That's what you call. When you putting them side by side with you, those are called your day ones. The ones who had your back. The ones who were fighting just like you were fighting. So with that being said, y'all, the first little thing is something I already reacted to. Some of y'all probably already watched the reaction that already dropped. Um, just who Donald Trump is going to have in charge of the um, Department of Government, which is Elon Musk. And uh, I hope I say his name right. Vivid. Oh, hopefully I say that name right. I probably screwed it up. But yeah, those are the two he's choosing for that. And they're going to definitely clean house. You know what I'm saying? They're going to do what they do. Okay. And they are right for that. Of course, they've been flooding the um TL all day to day. You know, what we would call it trolling. Okay. This says from Big Pete and Y. That's my boy, y'all. That's my boy. Still my favorite, Matt Gazy. Hopefully I said that last name right. I probably screwed it up. Oh, well. Moment voting for House Speaker nomination. Donald John Trump. Okay, let's dive into it, y'all. Let's see here. Boom. Donald John Trump. Trump. Uh, look at how uh, Marjorie looking at him like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> let's see that again. Donald John Trump. Look how Marjorie look. Yeah. <laughs> that's funny oh man that's how you do it breaking exclusive former congresswoman was it Talisi? Gabbard has been chosen by president trump to be the director of national intelligence okay look at trump putting everybody on that is what's up man and i believe she was a former democrat am i not mistaken um after 16 years why are you quitting let me see. i once believed that it was a place for honest people. hi guessing. everyone i have loved connecting with all of you on twitter and then on x for all of these years mm -hmm. but it's time for me to leave the platform i once believed that it was a place for honest debate and discussion mm. transparency and free speech but i now feel it does not serve that purpose in addition, starting this Friday, November 15th, X is implementing new terms of service, which, among other things, states that, quote, all disputes be brought exclusively in the U.S. District Court for the Northern District of Texas or state courts located in Tarrant County, Texas, end quote. The full terms of service can be found on my written statement or on the X website. Now, as the Washington Post recently reported on X's decision to change the terms, this, quote, ensures that such lawsuits will be heard in courthouses that are a hub for conservatives, which experts say could make it easier for X to shield itself from litigation and punish critics. Hmm. I think that speaks for itself. You can find me on YouTube at The Don Lemon Show or on TikTok and Facebook at Don Lemon hmm. and on Instagram and Blue Sky at Don Lemon Official. I hope you will join me there. He Thanks. helps. He helps, y'all funny y'all he mentioned all those other social medias and they all kind of linked together but okay we finna keep it moving that wasn't really nothing said there breaking governor of illinois says local law enforcement won't cooperate with raids and deprivations of illegals in his state hmm look at him people who are frankly holding down Hang on, and let's hear this man from the, from the top now what you got to say but uh, we also want to make sure that there isn't a, a violation of people's rights with, uh, you know, raids, for example, uh, that are done in coordination with local law enforcement on people who are, frankly, holding down jobs and have been in this country for many, many years. Um, we think that's improper. And in Illinois, that's not something that uh, we would condone. There's been some talk about using other states' uh, National Guard, uh, red state National Guards, to, to somehow come into a blue state and uh, try and enforce these mm. new Stephen Miller-inspired uh, rules. And uh, and that's just not something we're going to accept. But but I want. But uh, we also want to make sure that there isn't a, a violation of people's rights with uh, you know 
raids, for example, uh, is that it are done over? in coordination with local law enforcement. Oh, yeah, it what? is. Okay, yeah, of course, everybody's going to, some people are not going to agree with it. If it has anything to dealing with, you know, you're not coming over here the right way. You're going to have to back up and leave. I'm sorry. Well, she told her parents to remove her and her kids from the wheel. Okay, I think we got a meltdown. Let's get it. Longer have the privilege of having their. Hang on, let's hear it from so the beginning. Last night, I told my mom and dad that because they voted for someone who wants me dead, that they no longer have the privilege of having their daughter and their granddaughters in their life. Hmm. And I told them never contact me again. I'm never calling you. I want nothing to do with you. And take me out of the will. I have a younger brother who is also a MAGA. I said, when you guys pass away, give him the entire house. I don't want to inherit your house. I don't want anything from you. I don't want to hear from you ever again. Because I'm no longer safe being in a relationship with you. Oh. Because I'm queer. I'm autistic. I'm, like, half disabled. <laughs> I have Lyme disease and POTS and a bunch of other shit. And I'm bisexual. I have two daughters. And my husband's also bisexual. It's like, <laughs> wow. I'm no longer safe with people like you. You'd be the first ones to turn me into the Nazis. Oh my god! If shit went down here, enough so, is enough. Just, and to anyone in the comments, it's gonna say, "Oh my god, that's so terrible." Yeah, enough is enough. Enough is so hateful. Enough you is enough. Cutting off your family. You know what? I'm not gonna fucking mm. go to Thanksgiving dinner with my family and look them in the eye and and just play nice anymore. Mm. Like I'm done doing this. I have been gaslit and neglected and verbally abused by my family for being different my entire life and i've cut off all my aunts and uncles anyone who voted for trump anyone who's a christian in my family i know they voted for trump so i have like three people in between my i have two people on my mom's side and one person on my dad's side left mm. and their cousins sad for you because yeah and Ooh. I I have my husband, I have my two daughters, mm. and that's all I need. Okay. I I'm not going to be gaslit and yeah, okay. I'm not gonna be gaslit anymore. Okay. I'm done girl. living this life. So good riddance. Bye. Bye, girl. <laughs> Bye. I almost yarn. Boy, these people are salty. <laughs> they salty, y'all. They salty. Everybody on him because he stood up and did what he's supposed to do, y'all. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. Oh, my goodness. Donald Trump. Our Hang on. Y'all. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> y'all, Matt Gates. Oh, my goodness. Matt Gates. Okay. Donald Trump, our next president of these United States of America. The president-elect Donald Trump announced that Matt Gates will be the next attorney general. Come on. <laughs> Look at that, y'all. Y'all do not understand how great this is. Matt Gates is not coming to play. None oh, of yeah. them. <laughs> <laughs> I know the left is running scared right now. The Democrats are running scared. Matt Gates is not going to play. He is going to do what is right for this country. And he will make sure Ooh. to wipe out all of this corruption. Let's go, baby. Man, oh. y'all, this is what's up. <laughs> like, Trump is not. Do y'all hear me? Trump supporters, everybody who's, who supports Trump, do y'all hear me? He is putting the right people in place. This is crazy. I, just, I got chills. Like, he put everybody that is not coming to play that is going to get the job done come January. That's what's up, man. I got chills. This is what's up. The boss is back. Yes, he is. Let's check it out. Coming straight from Kingdom Reacts. <laughs> That's my husband, y'all. Let's get into it. Appreciate it very much. A transition that's so... Hang on. Well, Mr. President, elect and former president, Donald, congratulations. Thank you. And uh, looking forward to having, a, like they said, a smooth transition. Do everything we can to make sure you're accommodating what you need. We're going to get a chance to talk about some of that today. It's good. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you. Jim, man. Thank you very much. And uh, politics is tough. And it's, uh, in many cases, not a very nice world. But 
It is a nice world today, and I appreciate it very much. And a transition that's so smooth, it'll be as smooth as it can get. And uh, I very much appreciate that. You're welcome. Well, Mr. President, that is just uh, y'all. I'm gonna keep saying this. Biden was rooting for Trump in the background, like yeah, 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 yeah. Y'all, Biden, like I'm happy. I am so happy. He was low key rooting for him in the back. X is better than <laughs> Elon is off the chain. Tom McDonald drove three hours for this and uh, met awesome people. Met awesome people and took off photos, signed a, a lot of hats. Hat. Okay. Blah. Signed a lot of hats. Had a ton of fun. The next four years are going to rock. I love me some Tom McDonald, y'all. Y'all don't know that. Don't forget the ones who died for our freedom. Let's go. The way we're treated ain't been fair. Fake news on every TV. Mm. Four years we've been in this nightmare. What a killed American dream. We can't afford our lives here. Ran food and gasoline. These colors don't run and I only want it once. Buddy, don't tread on me. I won't forget the ones who died for our freedom. And I ain't gonna hand it back. No, no, no. If liberty and justice ain't enough to believe in, then get out of here and don't look back. Go, go, go. We love our home. America is losing out, hope to... hey. And it's just like that, y'all. I have to. I must admit that my first Trump rally and final Trump rally because he's finally in the office was so much fun. It is just like that. Nothing but mad love, surrounded by people that actually genuinely love you and were actually wanting the same thing i will not take that moment back i had a blast and to be able to actually see trump for the first time on stage was amazing i will keep this memory with me for years and years and years to come so i can tell my children's children's children this story and that's how it's gonna be y'all <clears throat> excuse me i'm sorry well that's it looks like you know, on my X feed, I like doing this. Let me see. Did I care when follows with the work? I'm doing you want everyone to support it. Oh, this is um what's his name? Let's hear what he got to say, y'all. Then we're gonna end it up. We're gonna end it with him. This is like admin central. Listen, Elon Musk retweeted my video, and here we go. Everybody I'm is. craving white validation. Elon Musk is a white supremacist. He's not sharing the video with pure intentions. He better be donating to the program. He better be doing this and that and etc. Listen, first of all, even if he never gives a dime to our organization, he has shared our video at which almost 30 million people have seen in less than 24 hours, many of whom have emailed, have donated, have sent things from our Amazon wish list, have decided to follow, have shared with their friends, have invited me up. on podcasts, radio shows, etc. all happening next week. This has opened up many doors for what we're trying to do. And if you were a true supporter of mine and the work that we do, teaching kids skill trades, having a school, trying to make sure these kids know what they're supposed to know, you wouldn't be so freaking upset just because somebody shared it that you don't like. It don't matter. It's publicity. And if you believe in my message, you should want anybody to hear it. If you believe in what I'm doing, you should want anybody to hear it, whether they're racist or not, rich or poor, etc. If you believe in my message, you want everybody to hear it. Just like y'all was hollering about Kamala, y'all wanted everybody to hear her message. Just like some of you have supported Preach. Trump, you want everybody to hear his message. Preach. So if you support me and my message and what we're trying to do for young men in our community, you keep supporting what we're doing. You'd want everybody to hear it. Stop with the nonsense and all this trash y'all talking. If you want to keep unfollowing, and please keep, continue doing that because Do we that. need your fake support anyway. Okay, bye bye. Okay, drops mic. That's it. We ended it like that. All right, the new merge king. That's what's up. Like at the end of the day, y'all go support. Okay, I approve this message. 
I approve this message. That is it for your girl, y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed the X News feed where we can find meltdowns. We can find. <laughs> I love the meltdowns, y'all. Oh, my God. Keep those because I'm in, baby. Because when I tell you they salty, they are salty. And they're like, oh, don't do this. You're one of the people that do. Man, I kill it. We don't want to hear none of that because y'all did not care. Y'all didn't. Y'all didn't. Y'all didn't have no sympathy or nothing like that. Y'all did not care. So why should we, the people, care? Okay, just keep them coming so we can keep laughing because that's exactly what y'all was doing. All right, y'all, that's it for your girl. Y'all remain safe. Be safe. Be safe out there. Okay, until the next reaction. I love y'all. Thank y'all so much for your support. I'm out.